Hello, good evening. How are you? Hello, teacher. Good evening. Good evening, Walter. Good evening, Carla. Good evening. How are you, Walter? How was your day? Uh, I am relaxed. Oh, really? Yes. Oh. On a Monday and relaxed? That's nice. Yes. Okay, and tell me, did you go to work today? Did you go to work, Walter? Uh, so, so, teacher. Okay, thank you, Walter. Carla, good evening. How are you? How are you? Good evening. I am fine. Okay, and how was your day? Tell me. I am tired. You're tired? Why? Did you have a heavy day? Tell me. Did you have a heavy day, Carla? I not entered it. Did you, in the past, do a heavy, difficult day? How was your day? I, a lot of work. A lot of activities? Sí, a lot, yes. Okay. That's good, that's good. Thank you, Carla. Felicita, good evening. Good evening, teacher. How are you? How was your day, Felicita? A little, a little bit tired. I was a long day, but I am okay. Okay, excellent, excellent. Thank you, Felicita Carlos. Good evening, how are you? You're welcome. Good evening, everybody. How are you, Carlos? Yeah, I'm fine. How I was your day? Um, uh, very good. I can uh, make all my activities in the time on time. Okay. I don't have any problem. Excellent, excellent. Just remember that as you are talking in past, instead of saying I can, I we could. say I could because it's in the past. Okay. Okay, thank you, Carlos. Andrea, hello. Good evening, teacher. How are you? Fine, thanks. Okay, and tell me, how was your day, Andrea? Um, good day, bad day. Very good. Heavy? Very good, very good. Okay, and tell me, how's the weather over there? How's the weather? El clima. Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, how do you say no loud, teacher? Cloudy. Oh, cloudy. Okay. And is it windy? Is it windy? Okay. Windy. Right. Yes. I don't know. Teacher. Windy. Con mucho viento. Oh, uh, no. 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 Is it mm -mm. hot or cold? Hot or cold? Hot. It's hot. Hot. Interesting. 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 Thank you, Andrea. Mm -hmm. Let's well, see who else is here. Helen. Hello, Helen. How are you? Helen, good evening. Good evening. How are you? Ready I'm for the fine. class? Excuse me? Are you ready for the class? Ready. Excellent, excellent. How was your day, Helen? 
a good ah. day, a bad day, a so so, a regular day. Uh, I have a good day. A good day. Oh, excellent, excellent. That's nice to hear. Thank you very much, Helen. Mariela, hello, Mariela, how are you? Hello, I'm fine, thank you. So tell me, Mariela, how was your day? It's great day. A good day? Great. Great, wow, excellent. <laughs> That's nice. That's a good attitude. So tell me, uh, what about traffic? Was there a lot of traffic today? A lot of traffic. Really? Terrible? Yes, horrible. Okay, okay. Horrible. 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 Well, actually, traffic can also be hectic. Hectic. Yes, hectic is like, is like saying complicated. Okay. Very complicated. Okay. But the good thing is that you are here in class. Excellent. Excellent. Thank you, Mariela. Thank Grecia, you. good evening. Hi, good evening, mister. Good evening, everybody. How are you, Grecia? Oh, I'm fine. It was a good day, mister. Okay, okay. Tell me why. Oh, attend many clients, um, attend, sorry, receive many documents. Okay. Yes. Yeah. Re receive, receive. Receive. Perfect. Okay. So okay, thank you. A busy day. Thank you, Grecia. Fausto, good evening. How are you, mister? Good evening, teacher. Uh, very well. Very well. Okay, how was your day? Uh, my day is uh, heavy. Was, was, because it's in the past. My day was heavy. Was, pardon. My, my day was heavy. A lot of activities, many things to do. Um, a lot of process order. Oh, really? Yeah. Good news for the company, bad news for you. What? Good news for the company. Buenas noticias para la compañía. Bad news for you. Yeah. A lot of work. <laughs> ah, that's the way it is. Okay, thank you very much, Fausto. You're welcome. Miss Yesenia. Hello, how are you, Miss? Hello, fine, teacher. Yesenia, we were missing you last class. Uh, um, quiero ver. Es que lo quiero decir en inglés, pero no sé cómo. Quiero ver. You can tell me and I can help you. I... Como dolor de cabeza. I, oh, I had a, I, I had a headache. No. I had, I had a, a headache. Headache. Oh, that's a problem. Yeah, I know what. I had a headache. Eh, le escribí a la señorita del corporativo que no me sentía bien. Okay, but the good thing is that you're here today. That's what <laughs> it's important. Let's see, let's see. Thank you very much, Yesenia. Miss Alonso Antonio Turcios, okay, good evening. How are you? Good evening. How I'm are you, fine. Mister? Thank you. Great, excellent, excellent. So tell me, how was your day? Oh, my day was, oh, bueno, I have a very heavy day, oh. but in the end, it was worried because I did everything I wanted. Okay, so that's good. That's good. The good thing is that when we have a lot of activities, we do not feel the day. Cuando tenemos muchas actividades, no sentimos el día. 
So that's, that's good. Co that's correct. Thank Remember, you. Remember, when we have many activities, we do not feel the pass of time. Nos sentimos el paso del tiempo. Okay? That's correct. Thank you, Miss. Okay. Let's see, let's see. Miss Valencia, Noemi, hello, good evening. How are you? Good evening. How are you, Miss? I'm fine, thank you. How was your day? Um, yeah, I, I was have. I um, have? Very, I have a day very difficult. Oh, I really? prepared that. Wow, so mm -hmm. it was very Well, don't worry, Mami. Right now you are in class, you are relaxed, so we are going to have fun. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Let me remind, let me just check that somebody text a little something here. Just let me get rid of this and we are ready to start our class. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh, problems with internet. Okay, no problem. We are going to be waiting for everybody to connect. Okay. So let's see, guys. And today I'm going to make the question a little bit bigger, okay? Today we are going to make the question a little bit bigger because I've been just asking you how was your day, but now I'm going to ask something a little bit longer, okay? So let's see, Mariela, tell me, how was your weekend? What did you do on weekend? Um, did you go to work? Yes. How do you say Puse. Put. Puse. Put. I put. Put. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I put the Christmas tree. Oh. In, in my work. Oh, really? Cool. Yes. Is it big? It's very big. Oh, really? How long? Yeah. How long? How much time did it take you? Uh, An hour, two hours, three hours. Two two hours. Wow, a lot of work. It's very big. Oh, nice. Yes. nice, nice. Very interesting, actually. And tall. Okay, and it, we are uh, November 16th. And you got the tree already in. Cool. Thank you. Uh, in yes, uh, me, in the weekend, in the oh. weekend, uh, on Saturday. Oh, really? You did it on Saturday. What about Sunday? What did you do on Sunday? Um, I get up and... What time, did you, what time did you get up on Sunday? I get up at 8 a.m. At 8 a.m.? Yes. And prepare uh, a breakfast. Okay. Oh. To my kids. Okay, okay. Just remember that as we are talking in past, you say, I got up. I got up. Okay. I got up. Okay, very good. Interesting. Got... Interesting. Okay, mm -hmm. guys. And let's see. Let's see. Just give me a little second that I just remember something. My gosh. They're going to tell me off. Okie dokie. Thank you, Mariela. Very nice. You're welcome. Okay, guys. Hello. I need to take the attendance, please. Carla Marielos Guevara Callejas. Carla, present? Present. Thank you. Present. Fausto Antonio Landaverde Lopez. Present. Thank you. 
Eh, Mariela de Los Ángeles, Alvarado Díaz. Present. Thanks. Carla Colocho de Parada. Eliani Alejandra Nativi. Oh, problem. Internet. Walter Mauricio Morales Araujo. Present teacher. Thank you, Walter. Eh, Soyla Noemi Córdoba de Valencia. Hello. Present. Thank you. Carlos Alberto Bautista Bonilla. Present. Thanks. Yesenia de Lourdes Magaña Sandoval. Present. Thanks. Jorge Alexander Reyes López. Present. Blanca Margarita Chávez Pérez. Blanca, let's see, let's check. No, Blanca is not here. Okay. Uh, Felicita Cruz de Pereira. Present. Thank you. Grecia Yulisa Pereira de Villegas. Thank you, Grecia. Helen Maria Chávez Quintanilla. Present. Present. Thank you. Giovanni Vladimir Escamilla, not here. Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales. Not here either. And Alonso Antonio Turcios. Present. Okay, Mr. Alonso, thank you. Andrea Natalie Espinalo Mansor. Andrea, Andrea. Yeah, perhaps the signal. It's it's very windy. Present. Thank you. Thank you, Andrea. I heard you. I heard you now. Excellent. Now, let's see. Wendy Susana Perez, not here. And Pedro Antonio Hernandez, not here either. Okay, guys. Today, oh, I was asking you about the weekend. So, tell me, Andrea, what did you do on weekend? What did you do on Sunday? What time did you wake up on Sunday morning? Andrea, can you hear me? I was asking you, Andrea, Hola. I was asking you, uh, what did, what time did you wake up on Sunday, yesterday? Um, wake up. Um, um, Quarter to six. On Sunday? Oh, some, oh yesterday, Sunday. Yesterday, yes, yesterday. <laughs> oh, no, no. Sunday, seven. Seven o'clock. Oh, oh, come on, Andrea. It's Sunday. You can sleep late. Mm, no. You don't like to sleep late? No. Oh, cool. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see. What about you, Yesenia? What time? Thank you, Andrea. What time did you wake up yesterday? Um, I, I woke up. Woke up. I, I woke up at 8 o'clock. Levantarme. No, actually, wake up is this. Look at I this. wake up at eight, eight o'clock. Yes, wake up is when you open your eyes. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's to wake up. Get up. Ah, cuando abro mis ojos. Ah, es levantarme. No, hay una okay. diferencia entre despertarse y levantarse. Okay. Wake up, despertarse. Get up, sí, sí, levantarse. Sí. Okay. So let's see. My gosh, everybody wakes up okay. early. Let's see. What about you, Jorge? Tell me. What time did you wake up yesterday on Sunday? I, I wake up. I uh, woke up. I woke up. It's in past. 
I woke up uh, uh, five. Good evening. Five. At five. Wow! Yesterday. Ayer. Yes. <laughs> yes. Really? <laughs> Why did you have to go to work? No, um, I don't. I don't have a sleep. I didn't sleep. Yeah. All right. Yes. Wow. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Now. Uh, Fausto, where's Fausto? Where's Fausto? Fausto's gone. Oh, there's Fausto. Fausto, tell me, what time did you go to sleep on Friday night? Tell me. Um. <laughs> this is the question. This is the question. Look at the. La, um, Friday night? 11. Yeah. That, that was the question. What time did you go to sleep last Friday? Wow, 11. Very early. Very early. Let me see. In my case, uh, last Friday actually it was Saturday. I went to sleep at 3 a.m. Wow. wow. <laughs> I don't sleep that much because I woke up at, at 6 30. 6.30? Yeah. And on Saturday, yeah, and on Saturday I went to sleep at uh, midnight, 12 p.m. Oh. So <laughs> I, I don't sleep that much. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Saturday I went to sleep at 2, at 2 a.m. I just remember. Yeah, I sleep around three, four hours at night. So, thank you, Fausto. What about you, Francisco? Tell me. You're welcome. Tell me, Francisco, uh, how many hours do you sleep per night? I sleep per night. Four, six, or... From four to six. Yeah. From four to six hours. Okay, that's a nice hour. From four to six hours. Okay, very good. It's um, every night. Okay. That happens every night. Okay, thank you very much. Yeah. Now, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Today, we are going to work with adverbs of frequency. You know, do you remember that last week, working with simple present? And we were saying that simple present, it is used to express facts, habits, and routines, right? Remember, simple present, it is used to express facts, habits, and routines. Now, when we talk about routines or about habits, we are talking about things that happens with frequency, regularly, okay? So, when we talk about things that happen with a certain frequency, with regularity, we need some little words. These little words are called adverbs of frequency. And they express how often do we do something. Like, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Walter, tell me, Walter, how often do you cut your hair? Uh, do your hair uh, how often uh, do you cut your hair do you cut your hair uh, um, weekends every weekend yes okay you have to say I cut my hair every weekend say my phrase every look at the, weekend look at the chat look at the chat I put it in the chat. I cut my hair every weekend. Thank you. I cut my hair every weekend. Perfect. What about you, Helen? How regularly do you cut your hair? Excuse me? 
no how, le entiendo nada. How regularly, que tan regularmente, look at me, look at the camera, do you cut, do you cut your hair? Oh, um, este, anual, ¿cómo se dice? Yearly. Yearly, sí. Okay, so you have to tell me, I cut my hair. Cut my hair. On a yearly basis. That means with a frequency of a year. Or a that year. means once a year. Significa una vez al año. Okay. Wow. Okay. Yearly. <laughs> Interesting. What about you, Mariela? Tell me, how regularly do you cut your hair? I cut my hair monthly. Monthly? Wow. Yes. Oh, yeah. Because you like to wear it cut, short. Yes, short. You like to wear it short. I like uh, it. What about you, Andrea? How regularly do you cut your hair? I cut my hair twice a year. Twice a year? Wow. Uh, look, never do it like Walter. Walter cuts it every week. <laughs> yeah, interesting. This guy likes to be like very ordered. That's nice. Now, Fausto, tell me how often, look, how often. How often means exactly the same as saying how regularly, okay? So, how often, Fausto, do you shave? Um, I shave uh, every week. Okay, now, but I see that you got a big bird. So, you shave just these parts. Yeah. And the rest, I imagine that you trim. You trim it. Okay? Trim. This, you shave. Right? Uh -huh. And the rest? Did you trim it? Yeah. Trim is darle forma, recortar, okay? Not cut, okay. trim, okay? It's trim. Yeah, so you trim it. Wow, yeah. interesting, yeah. interesting. So, how long since the last time you shaved completely? Santa Claus. <laughs> last Christmas? Uh -huh. ¿Cuándo, ¿Cuándo se rasuró completamente last time? When oh. did you shave completely last time? Uh, I don't remember. Wow. Nice. Oh, yeah, four or oh, three years. Years. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Nice, nice. When I was young, I used to do that. Cuando yo era joven hacía eso, but now, uh, uh, many, <laughs> many white hair. I got white hairs in my beard, in my mustache, a lot in my head. So I look, I do look like Santa Claus if I leave it like this. <laughs> uh. Okay, what a, thank you, Fausto. You're welcome. What about you, Carlos? Tell me, Carlos, how regularly do you shave? Uh, two times in the week. Two times a week? Cool. So you don't have that problem? No, no. Cool, nice. That's nice. I hate to shave. I don't like it. Okay, okay. Yesenia. Don't worry, don't worry, Yesenia. I'm not going to ask you about shaving. Tell me, Yesenia. How regularly do you change, or how often do you change your glasses? Um, ¿Cuánto tengo de no cambiar los lentes? No. Así, how regularly, tengo? regularmente, how, one, uh -huh. once a year, ¿qué tan a menudo? Pero de cambiar. Okay, look, when I ask you, how regularly 
No, es lo mismo que le pregunto how, how often y cuando hago esa pregunta le estoy diciendo qué tan a menudo right qué tan a menudo yes. okay can you how regularly do you change your glasses qué tan a menudo los cambios qué tan yes exactly that ah No sé cómo se dice cada. Every year. Cada dos años. Pero no oh, sé okay. cómo se dice cada. Ex listen, listen, listen. Every year. Every two. Every two years. Every two years. Thank you, Yesenia. Okay, let's see. Now. Let's check the, the conversation that we have for today because we have a conversation for today. So let me share with you guys. Okie dokie, let's see where it is, it's right here. Okay, our conversation for today is in page number 19. Okay, but let's see, here is the conversation. So let's see. Okay, guys, we are in the conversation for page number 19. Listen to the conversation, listen and read. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. How often do you Call your clients. I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Order. Do you call clients? Yes. I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, guys, let me just take the picture of the conversation so you can have it. There you go. Okay, I will read it again. Please listen. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay. Now, usually I ask you about if you have questions about the vocabulary, but today we are going to do it different. We are going to listen to it, read, practice the conversation, interact with everybody, and at the end, we are going to analyze for vocabulary, okay? So right now, no questions about vocabulary. Don't worry about that. En este momento no se preocupen por el vocabulario, okay? At all. We are going to cover that later. So right now, I'm going to divide you so you can work. Oh, perfect. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay, so you can work in pairs with the conversation. I send it to you to the group. You can have it. Please go to the rooms.
check the group. Creo que tengo el manual acá. Sí, déjame ver. Tengo el manual. Yeah. I send the picture to your cell phones. Les mandé la fotografía a los celulares. Okay. 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 ¿Qué página es? 19. Ok. que mandaron ahorita de la página 19 yes exactly that Blanca Ajá. good night teacher oh, oh, Blanca good evening good evening good evening <laughs> remember that good night is when you want me to say bye yes, I'm sorry oh. but I, I, I was worried I thought she just appeared and she wants to go now okay <laughs> okay practice ladies Okay. Okay. Uh, Miss John, how often do you check oh, your email? Email. Email. Okay. I once often a week. call. Okay. Listen, listen, listen. Once Yesenia. a week. Yesenia. Mm -hmm. Often. Hola. Often. 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 Yes, the letter ah, okay. oh. the letter T face no sound, okay? Often. So how often? Often. Okay. I often okay. I don't make the call the one once a week. Once on month. No sé por qué no me deja. Compartir. No me deja compartirla. Egoísta. But, but you have it, you have it in the, in the, in the. No me deja compartirle la. But you have it in the WhatsApp. La tiene en WhatsApp. I send it to you. Te la mandé. Okay. You can check it there. It's page 19 from the manual. Si no, es la página 19 del manual. Okay. Okay, otra vez. Change. How often Remember do to switch. Check your mail. Hello, Eliani. Hello, good evening. Good evening, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Oh, thank you, Eliani. What a beautiful t-shirt you have, Noemi. Excuse me? What a beautiful, beautiful t-shirt, t-shirt you have. Yes. Thank you, t-shirt. Nice. Yes. Very nice. <laughs> Thank you. Teacher, creo que. Hello. What happened, Fausto? Hello. Uh, creo que hubo problema de conexión de internet, entonces no sé si me salí yo o se salió Felicita. I think Felicita. Okay, hold on. Hold on, and we are going to move Felicita. Again, you are group seven, right? Mm. Mm. No. Hold on, Fausto. Let's see. I'm going to move you to another group. Hello, Natalie, Wendy. Hello. Hello, hello. Okay, Fausto is here to practice with you at least one time. Please help him that he was left alone. Me lo abandonaron. So 
Please, make it practice at dollars. least once. Háganme lo practicar al menos una vez, por favor. Ok, ok. Because we just have 60 seconds. Ya solo tenemos 60 segundos. Ok, okay thank you, teacher. You're welcome. Uh, si gusta, empiece. Bye, ok. Um, how often do you share your... Okie dokie. Hello, hello, hello. Almost everybody's here. Okay. Didn't I have Fausto working? Que no dejé a Fausto a media conversación. And he's here. You finished, Fausto? No, eh, eh, teacher, eh, me sacó el, eh, el sistema. Me quedé sin internet. Really, that's weird. That's weird because I gave you guys yeah. 60 seconds. Yo les había dado 60 segundos. That's weird. Me, me quedé sin internet. Por eso no, no, no sabía qué hacer. Okay, no problem, no problem. Okay, guys, let's see, let's see, let's see. Who's got the microphone open first? ¿Quién tiene el micrófono abierto? Oh, Yesenia. Hello, Yesenia. You're first. Okay, Yesenia and... I am going to tell who's going to be your partner, okay? Yesenia and Carla Marielos, please. Let's do it. Okay. There you go. There you have it. Okay. Yes, oh. yes. yes. Okay. Yo, yo empiezo yo si quiere, Carla. Está bien. Carla. Ok, está bien. How often do you check? How, how, how often? often? Often. Do you check? Often. How often do you check for a... Do, how often do you check your email? Every two hours, and you? Well, I try to, che to check it as of often. Se me, se me va la palabra. As I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them. Once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes. I, I always can ca them. call them, them the first all them thing first thing in, in the, the morning. morning. I believe it is important. Thirty in the morning. in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, perfect. Just remember, everybody, please listen to me. How often do you check your email? every two hours and you well i try to check it as often as i can and how often do you call your clients i often call them once a week on monday but i usually call them on friday to check their order do you call clients yes i always call them first thing in the morning I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay. Thank you very much, ladies. Now let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Okay. Who's going to be next? Okay. Felicita and Blanca. Blanca Margarita. Blanca, you start. Okay. Yeah. With Helen. How often do you check your email? Every two hours, and you? 
Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a, a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their orders. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first things in the morning. I believe it's, it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Perfect, excellent, well done, well done. Just remember, uh, every, no, I'm sorry. Often call them, often call them. Usually, usually. Okay. 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 Excellent job. Mr. Carlos Bautista and Fausto Antonio, please, Carlos, you start. Okay. Uh, let me see. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday. But I usually call, call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it, it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, perfect, perfect, perfect. Excellent, guys. Well done. Very good job. Now, thank you. Now, Mariela de Los Angeles saying Miss Noemi de Valencia. How often do you check your email? Every two hours and you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check the order. Yes. Es que se va el audio. Yes, yes. I always call them, call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, okay, excellent, excellent. Very well done, ladies. Good job. Now, let's see. Um, nom, 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 nom. Helen and Francisco. Yeah. How often do you check your emails? How often? Um... Uh, I'm sorry, I'm going to check to share the screen. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, my bad. Hold on just a second. Every two hours, can you? Well, I try to check it is it as often as I can. And how often do you call your client? I often call them once a week on Monday, but uh, I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is it is important to have contact with them all the time. You're right. Perfect. Well done. Well done. Well done. Just remember, please, Miss. Try. I try. Try. I try. Perfect. Excellent. Thank you, Francisco. Walter and Eliani. Please, Walter, you start. I check how 
how often do you check your email? Every two hours, and you? Well, I try to check in Austin, I and come, and how often do you care your clients? I often call them once or a week on the Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call the first thing in the morning. <clears throat> I believe it is important to have contact with the old and die. You are right. Okay, very well, very well. Just remember what I try, try, and here, call. I try call, and hear. Call your clients. Call, call your, your clients. clients. Thank you, Ditch. No, thank call you. Very well, very well. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Oh man, you move your camera. Tenía gente aquí con la cámara. Let's see who was that. Okay, Andrea, in Grecia, please. Okay. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I call once a week on Monday, but I usually call ten on Friday to check the order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, excellent. Very well done. Just remember, usually, usually, and believe, I believe. Okay. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's see, let's thank see. You. Oh, you changed the order of this. So let's see, Carlos, you participated already? Yes, right? Yes, Alonso and Alonso and Jorge. Okay. Let me share it. <clears throat> How often do you check your email? Every two hours, and you? Well, I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call the first thing in the morning. I believe it's important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Okay, very well done, guys. Perfect, excellent, excellent, excellent. So let me see who do I have missing. Wendy Azucena and Mr. Pedro Antonio, please. Please, very please. Puede compartir, Tichola. Okay, Pedro, you start. Okay. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? Well, I try to check. Uh, it is as often as I can. Uh, how often do you call your clients? 
I often call them once a week, um, Monday, but I usually call them on Friday to check the order. Do you call client? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it's important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. Perfect, thank you very much. Now, everybody, listen again. How often do you check your email? Every two hours. And you? I try to check it as often as I can. And how often do you call your clients? I often call them once a week on Monday. But I usually call them on Friday to check their order. Do you call clients? Yes, I always call them first thing in the morning. I believe it is important to have contact with them all the time. You are right. You are right. Okay, very easy, very easy, very easy. Now, questions about the vocabulary? Is there any question? No? no. Perfect, excellent, excellent. No. Excellent. Now, remember, guys, let me see. Let me share with you. Remember, how often? This is a question, and this question means cuán a menudo. Okay? We don't say that in Spanish. Here in Salvadorian, we say, eh, ¿qué tan seguido? ¿Con qué? Okay? But it's cuán a menudo. How often? So, it is asking about the frequency. Remember. Whenever you hear this question, how often they are asking you, how regularly? Siempre que vemos esa pregunta, nos están preguntando qué tan regularmente, okay? How often? Like, uh, let's see, Mariela, tell me, Mariela, how often do you brush your teeth? Never. Uh, I brush my teeth. Um five times como se dice veces five times. times five times a, a day. day perfect yes. excellent wow good good excellent excellent just like me i brush my teeth five times a week oh no a day <laughs> no, okay a day. thank you thank you thank you very well very well yeah everybody was like man i can feel it here okay so those are adverbs of frequency because if you remember, uh, the adverbs of frequency are like uh, always, never, okay? Because they express like, uh, like the idea of how regularly, like an average, un promedio, okay? The adverbs of frequency, they are not like exact. They tell us like an average. Adverbios de frecuencia nos dicen como un promedio. Okay, they are, they are not exact. In this case, as Mariela is exact, she tells me, oh, I brush my teeth five times a day. So that's to be exact. He's saying the Teacher. Yes. Uh, how do you say veces uh, in, in English? Times. Time. Times. Time. Look at the chart. Okay. Time. Okay. Thank you. Okay. In this case, remember, let's see. We have once, one time, twice, two times. Okay. But we don't say two times. We say once, twice. Okay. And then we say three times, four times. Remember that we have every todos, every day, every month, every week, every year, okay? Okay. So, but we can say it every month or we can say it monthly, okay? Now, we also have the expression, oh my gosh, it's very early, every other day. 
every other day. This expression means un día sí, un día no. Every other day. Okay? Every. That's every other day. Okay, okay. Now. Oops, it's 9 p.m., guys. I need to take the attendance again. Let's do it fast, fast, fast. Be ready. Pausa Antonio Landa Verde. Present. Carla Marielos. Present. Mariela de Los Ángeles. Present. Carla Colocho. Eliani Alejandra. Present. Walter Mauricio. Present. Soy la Noemi Córdoba. Present. Carlos Alberto Bautista. Present. Yesenia Magaña. Yesenia, Yesenia is somewhere around here. What is Yesenia? It's mute. Okay. Let's see. Jorge Alexander Reyes. Present. Blanca Margarita Chávez. Present. Felicita Cruz de Pereira. Present. Grecia Yulisa Pereira. Present. Helen María Chávez Quintanilla. Present. Giovanni Vladimir Quintanilla. Not here. Francisco Javier Villatoro Canales. Present. Alonso Antonio Turcios Brizuela. Present. Andrea Natalie Espinal Mansor. Present. Wendy Susana Pérez. Present. Pedro Antonio Hernández. Present. Okay. Thank you very much. I'm sorry, but it's a requirement. Lo siento, es un requerimiento. Now let's continue with our team. Let's see, let's check, let's check, let's continue. Okay, guys, so. Uh, we don't need that. Okay, ongoing activities at the workplace. That's the name of the unit. Now, how to use the adverbs of frequency? Okay, we use the frequency adverbs to say how frequently an activity happens. Okay, now, this always means always, 100%. All the time, okay? All the time. I always get up at five o'clock. That's all the time. Never, never is exact, okay? I never get late to work. Now, let me see, let me see. I'm sorry guys, but I need to mute everybody. Okay, now, it is very important that you remember exact Exact, just always and never, okay? Always and never are exact. Los únicos que son completamente exactos son always and never. Always, all the time, a hundred percent. Eso son todo el tiempo, cien por ciento, okay? Never, it's zero percent, okay? Now, the rest of them appears in an average, but it's like an idea. El resto parecen por ahí, pero es como una idea. Because when we talk about frequency, it is important that we remember that mostly it depends on context. Cuando hablamos de frecuencia, tenemos que recordar que la mayor parte del tiempo depende del contexto. Okay? Because I can tell you, oh, I always brush my teeth. I always br brush my teeth. Yo siempre me cepillo los dientes. Okay, but what's that? Oh, that's like every day. It's okay, you say. Always, 100%, all the time. Now, I, let's, uh, let's look at it. Check it out. I usually 
brush my teeth. Okay, I usually, it says here 90%, but the difference is, okay? Remember, when I talk about frequency, it depends on the context, because the, I always brush my teeth, for me, is three times a day. For Mariela, it's five times a day. You see, it's different, right? Si nos fijamos con las frecuencias, es un poquito de contexto. I can say, I always brush my teeth. Oh, but I brush them three times a day. Pero lo hago tres veces al día. For Mariela, always means five times a day. It's different, right? Para ella, always es tres al día. It's different. But we are using the same word. Always for me, always for her. And exactly, exactly the same idea, the same sentence. Estoy expresando la misma idea, la misma oración. But it varies according to the point of view. Varía, la, cuando hablamos de frecuencia, eso varía de acuerdo al punto de vista. Okay? That's why they, are, they express frequency. They are not exact. Por eso es que no son completamente exactos. And I'm sorry. ¿Eso sería always o sería usually? In this case, always. So, but what for me is always, if I tell it to Mariela, I tell Mariela, oh, I brush my teeth, Mariela, three times a day. Mariela says, oh, the teacher usually brushes her, his teeth because according to her point of view, for her, always is five times. Send me, Francisco. El, lo que varía es esto, Francisco. Que lo que para mí es siempre, cuando se lo explico a ella, para ella es usually. Porque para mí siempre es tres, pero para ella siempre es cinco. Entonces, desde el punto de vista de ella, in my case, en mi caso, is usually. You see? It depends on the point of view. So we must be careful. Remember, when somebody tells us about frequencies, they are not exact. And sometimes we are not talking about the exactly the same amount, the same quantity. I'm sorry, guys. Sorry, I'm sorry, it's my tea. It's because of my throat. Okay, let's continue, let's continue. Any other question? Francisco, is it clear for you? So, so. Yeah, thank you. Okay, perfect. Any other question? No? Okay, let's continue. Let's continue. Let's continue. Let me check. Okay, right here. So, look, we have usually, normally, often, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, hardly ever, rarely, never. Now, this sometimes is like a pointer for you, for everybody. Whenever we see sometimes, sometimes it's like a pointer for us. Remember, we have sometimes, sometimes is 50%, okay? The ones who are less than sometimes, sometimes it's like a this. okay? 50%. Los que están para abajo. Remember, always they are less than something. Son los que pasan menos. The ones who are going up more regularly. Okay? That's why we have the averages there. Okay. Normally, she normally checks her email. Often. I often have breakfast at work. Sometimes. She sometimes uses the microwave. Occasionally, I occasionally work overtime. Seldom. We seldom take calls at work. Hardly ever. Rarely. Okay, he rarely has conferences. Never. I never get late to work. 
Okay, so remember, look, when we say never, it's never. Now, something that you have to remember is this. If you look up on the internet or in books, you will find outbursts of frequency and sometimes you will find less or you will find more. Because remember, as I told you, they are not exact. You can also find a almost always and almost never. Those two are also adverbs of frequency. Almost always, casi, siempre. Almost never, casi nunca, okay? Those two are also adverbs of frequency. And in some books you will find them, in some others you don't. Okay, 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 okay. I'm sorry guys, but uh, remember that I speak all the time, so I need to cover. Okay, let's continue. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I know that Andrea is like this, like sweating, and in my house I am like this. It's a little bit cold here. So, let's see, let's see. Any question right now, up to here, hasta este momento, alguna pregunta? Tell me if you are understanding or not. Díganme si vamos entendiendo. If not, I explain again in a different way. Si no les explico de otra manera. En nuestro entorno normalmente usamos eh, frases como a menudo, a veces. Those are the adverbs of frequency. Okay. okay. Pero... If you say a menudo, eh, almost always. Always. Almost always. It means, almost always. It means yeah, almost, know. it means the Más same. Más del 50%. Or often. Often is exactly a menudo. Okay? So, mm -hmm. remember that those are, those that are more than 50%, you can use either of them. Que están arriba del 50%, puedo utilizar cualquiera para decir a menudo. Let's continue. Let's check again. Remember, we have often, normally, usually. Okay, usually, normally, often. Actually, guys, those three, usually, normally, often, I mean, depending on who's speaking, they say, oh, 80%, 60 70%, 60%. Depende quién no esté usando, va a decirle que es 80, 70, and 60. Van a decir que es 80%, 70, But actually, you can use either one of them. En ese rango se usa cualquiera. Okay? The same, exactly the same happens with the ones who are below sometimes. Occasionally, seldom, hardly ever. Okay, ocasionalmente, rara vez. I mean, it depends on who's speaking. Depende de quién esté hablando. Because for some, for some of you, occasionally and seldom could be the same. Para algunos de ustedes puede ser lo mismo. So, just be sure to remember the, the, the level where they are. Solo acuérdense de si están arriba del 50 o abajo del that's all that you need, okay? Don't be like trying to be specific with them, with them because they are not specific. No tratemos de ser específicos. No lo son, okay? The adverbs of frequency, they are not specific. They express frequency. They are not exact. No son exact. Unless you are talking about always or never. A menos que hablemos de always or never. Always, all the time, siempre. Never, never, zero. Never, nunca. But the rest of them, they vary. So don't worry about that. Now, what really matters to us is the structure. 
que sí nos interesa más es la estructura. ¿Ok? And let me share with you part of the structure. Ok. Mm, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, this is for later. It's not this, the one that I'm going to share. I'm sorry, my bad. What I'm going to share with you is, uh, let's see, where I have it. Oh, right here. Okay, 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 okay. Here it is. Okay. We use adverbs of frequency to answer the question, how often, right? We use adverbs of frequency to answer the question, how often? From now on, whenever I tell you, hey guys, how often do you, I am asking you to use an adverb of frequency, okay? De ahora en adelante, si les pregunto how often, usted me contesta con un adverbio de frecuencia, right? I always, I never, unless you want to be exact. And you tell me the exact number of times, right? A menos que usted vaya a ser exacto y me diga el número exacto. Otherwise, you use an adverb of frequency. De lo contrario, utiliza un adverbio de frequency. Let's continue. Okay. Now, we use a positive verb with hardly ever and never. Cuando tenemos hardly ever and never, utilizamos un verbo en forma positiva. ¿Ok? Like in the example, he never smokes. Why? Because we cannot say he doesn't never smoke. Why not? Because never is negative. And in a sentence, we cannot have double negation. So we say, he never smokes. Él nunca fuma. Instead of saying, él no nunca. You see, that's why we don't use it like this. We say, he never smokes. Now, the position. Adverbs of frequency go before all verbs. Before, ante. All verbs, except B. This is the order. Subject plus adverbs of frequency plus the verb. For example, she always plays tennis in the morning. They usually have lunch at work. Look, she always plays tennis in the morning. She, subject, always the adverb of frequency, plays the verb. She always plays tennis in the morning. They usually, you see, subject, adverb of frequency, and then the verb. They usually have lunch at work. Now, adverb of frequency go after the verb be. After is, after are, and after am. This was the Look at the example. We have the structure. Subject plus the verb to be plus adverb frequency. Look. She is always late for work. They are often hungry. Now. Look at this. In this case, we have subject. Adverb frequency, verb, right? In this case, is the opposite. She is, you see, subject, verb, but just when we talk about the verb be. She, the verb be, the adverb frequency. She is always, they are often hungry. She is always late for work. Now, 
in order for us to remember how they are used. Let's check again this example. You see, in this case, you see always, usually, normally, often, I always, he usually, she normally, I often, he sometimes, I occasionally. If you see the adverbs of frequency, they always come for all the verbs. Siempre van antes del verbo. With the exception of the verb be, con excepción del verbo ser o estar. You see? Get up. I get up at five o'clock. I always. He drives to work. He usually drives to work. She checks her email. She normally checks her email. I often have breakfast at work. She uses the microwave. He sometimes uses the microwave. I occasionally work overtime. You see, occasionally before work. We take calls at work. We seldom take calls at work. He has conferences. He rarely has conferences. I never get late to work. You see, never before get. So, relate to the position. Is there any question? En lo relacionado a la posición. ¿Alguna pregunta? Remember, subject, adverb of frequency, verb, okay? I always go to sleep very late. I always go to sleep very late. I, subject, always, adverb of frequency, go to sleep, the verb, okay? Any question? I know that this topic is a little bit complex. Any question? Yo sé que este tema es un poquito tough. Question? No? Let's continue then. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Again, my bad. My bad, guys. I'm sorry. I'm sharing again what's not. Right here. Okay, now, how often do you? We are going to practice. Okay, how often do you? Recuerdense que la pregunta how often es que tan a menudo. So we are going to ask each other how often do you? Nos vamos a preguntar how often do you brush your teeth? How often do you go dancing? How often do you? Stay up late. How often do you go to the movies? And how often do you do the laundry? So remember, all these come after this. How often do you brush your teeth? How often do you go dancing? How often do you stay up late? How often do you go to the movies? How often do you do the laundry? Okay? Any question about the vocabulary? Do you understand the meaning of the questions? Entendemos las preguntas? What the meaning stay? Stay up late. Stay up. Yes. Depelarse. Mm. Any other mm. question? No? Okay, perfect. So you need to ask your classmate this question. Ustedes necesitan preguntarle yeah. a su compañero. Okay? Okay. Okay, guys, just let me recreate all the rooms. Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I need to recreate the room. There you are. Please, jump in, guys, jump in. Hola. Hello. Hola. Hello. Está bien. 
Okay, you need to ask. You need to ask each other the question. Yes, the internet is giving problems. El internet está dando problemas. Okay. Um, how do you? How oh. often do you go to the movies? Um. Vamos a hacer esas esas preguntas. Ladies, no Spanish. And yes, you are going to ask those questions. Okay. Let's practice. Yes. How how often do you brush your teeth? In. Uh, always or I never. Or I saw my... Su nombre, su nombre es... Yesenia. Yesenia. Yes, Yesenia. Yesenia. Eh, always. Uh, occasionally. Occasionally. I occasionally. Oh, okay. I occasionally what? Uh, dancing. Okay, I occasionally go dancing. I go dancing. Okay, thank you. Remember thank you. to say the whole sentence, please. Mm -hmm. Fausto, how do you. I never. Uh -huh. dancing. What happened? I Hello? never got. You never go <laughs> dancing. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, I love dancing. I never. <laughs> no, Amy, you never go dancing. Yes, I love that. <laughs> Come on. <Solo> Navidad. <laughs> no, Amy. Christmas. You know, Only with, Christmas. You know with, with my wife, before the pandemic, we used to go dance regularly. Nice. Because we both, both okay. she and me, we love dancing. Mm, wow. Okay, continue. I love dancing. <laughs> okay, what's your favorite type of music, Noemi, for dancing? Uh, salsa. Oh. Mm -hmm. Me too. I love it. I love dancing salsa. Yeah. It's my mm -hmm. favorite music for dancing. Continue, ladies. Thank you. Okay. I rarely, rarely. I rarely, rarely. What? Do the laundry. Oh, really? Come on, Carlos. <laughs> my God, my wife uh, do the does, laundry does, every week. Does, does the laundry. Does the laundry every week. Oh, come on, man. No, I, I like to do the laundry. In the washing machine, it's very easy, not complicated. <laughs> well, it depends, because so, some of my clothing, I wash it in the washing machine, and some I wash it by hand. Delicate clothing? Yes, yeah, by hand. hand. By hand. By hand, okay. Yeah. And the only okay. thing... The only thing that I never, never let anybody do is iron. I iron all I, my clothes. I hate, I hate iron. Ironing. Ironing, ish. I love, <laughs> I love ironing my clothes. In my case, it's similar. Only I iron my clothes. Yeah, I know, I know. You are delicate with that. Yes. The same happens. One line. For each pant. Exactly. The same with the shirts. One exactly. line. Me too. That's why me I too. iron. I don't like nobody ironing for me. So me too. I, but I hate ironing. You. <laughs> no, in my case, I always iron my clothes. You see? Continue. Finish. Yes. You finish? Yes. Finish. Okay, just let me check the other groups and we'll see if we go back. Which one? 
este, the laundry, do, do the laundry, do the laundry, do the laundry, lavar ah, la ropa, lavar la ropa. Uh -huh. yeah. How often um, do you do the laundry, and Natalie? Teacher, pero solo se va a responder con el adverb. Yes, please. In this situation, yes, because it's an exercise of adverb. En este momento, sí, porque el ejercicio es específicamente de los adverbios. Actually, actually, okay. we usually yeah. answer that uh, given the, the times. Normalmente responderíamos diciendo la pesa. Mm -hmm. But in this case, in this moment, due yeah. to the exercise. So, how often do you, do you do the laundry, Andrea? I always... Do the laundry. Do the laundry. Yeah, la respuesta, mm -hmm. yeah. Nobody else does the laundry for you. In este momento me está diciendo que a usted nadie le ayuda a lavar su ropa. Right? Mm -hmm. Because you say, I always do the laundry. That means that just you wash your clothes. In my case, I sometimes do the laundry. Okay. Um, Sometimes another yeah. person does it for me. You see? Mm -hmm. Y usually, también podría ser en ocasiones yes. yo y en ocasiones yes. otra persona, ¿verdad? Yes. Usually. Usually. <laughs> Always. Three times My a day. Chip. Teacher, I... Hello, uh, Blanca. Tell me, tell me, tell me. I have a question. Porque in, uh, in the image say, I go to the movies. Movies is like cinema. Yes, it's like saying the movie theater. Es un modismo mm -hmm. para decir el cine. Ah, pero no es que vamos al cine, sino que veo películas. No, no, no. It's exactly that. Que va al cine. Um, to go go to the movies is I go to the movie theater. Actually, the whole phrase is like that. La frase correcta y completa es go to the movie. Theater. Um, okay, that's. Uh, it. Okay, es que yo pensé que solo cinema era solo cinema. <laughs> okay, no, you can say to the movies, to the movie theater, and if you are in England, if you're in England, to the movie theater. Entonces nosotros podemos contestar. How often do you go to the movies? I go to the movies occasionally. Ah, acuérdese de la posición. I occasionally go to the movies. Ah, va después del sub del. Yes, 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 subject, yes. Yes. After the subject, después del sujeto. Es que yo siempre confundo el after con el before, entonces no sé cuál es cuál. It's normal, it's normal. It happened to me when I was learning English. Es normal. Uh, Estaba uh -huh. aprendiendo. Uh, it's because... Ah, entonces siempre tenemos que decir, I never, for example, I never go to dance. I usually stay up late. Así. Yes, exactly. Ay, las había puesto al revés. <laughs> No problem, no problem. Okay, let, just let me check another group. We are almost done. Ya casi nos terminó el tiempo. Okay, gracias, thank teacher. You're welcome. Hey guys, finish? Finish. Perfect, let's go back to the main room. Okay. Okay.
we're just waiting for some people to come back. And let's see, we're going to start the other way around. Let's see, the first one are going to be, let's see, let's see. My dear Blanca, Blanca, you are first. Okay, teacher. Um, I have, pero voy a hablar sobre my partner. Yes, exactly. Tell me yes. about your partner. My partner, Helen, brushes your, her teeth. Excuse me, excuse me. Helen always brushes her teeth. Perfect. Excellent. Uh, next. Please. Okay. Helen never goes to dance. Oh, that's sad. Uh, that's very bad. Yeah. Okay. Helen usually stayed up late. Late. Perfect, late. Blanca. Enough, Blanca. Enough. Thank you very okay. much. Excellent. Now, Helen, tell me about Blanca. Please, I want to know. De, de el inicio o de donde la, ella quedó? Tell me three. It doesn't matter the order. I just need three. Uh, okay. Eh, Blanqui usual. Okay. Usually. Blanqui usuality stay usually stay up up the up late. Eh, Blanqui occasionality go to the movie. Blanqui always do the laundry. 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 Oh. And Blanqui remember. Always remember, Helen. When, as you are talking about okay. Blanca, you are saying, you are talking about her. You are talking about she. Blanca usually oh. does, does. Thank you, Helen. Excellent. Well done. Perfect. That's enough. Now, 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 let's see who is next. Okay, that was Blanca. Now, Francisco, tell me about Felicita, please. Okay. Felicita brushes her teeth three times a day. Okay. Yes, always. Okay, then you tell me Felicita always brushes her teeth. Okay. Felicita rarely go dancing. Uh, Samba. She yeah, do it two times a month. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Just remember, goes dancing because third person. Está hablando de la Ish, tercera persona. She, she, presente yeah. simple afirmativo. S okay. o S. Okay? Goes. One more. She stays up uh, late frequently. She frequently stays up late. Recuérdese oh. la posición. Sujeto, adverbio de frecuencia. Verbo. Okay. Perfect. Thank you very much, Francisco. You. Now, 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 now. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. That was Francisco. Uh, Andrea, tell me about Walter. Okay. Walter always brushes his teeth. Perfect. Walter usually goes dancing. Excellent. Walter sometimes stays up late. Perfect. Uh, Walter usually goes to the movies. Good. Walter sometimes does the laundry. Okay, very well. Thank you very much. Now, Felicita, tell me three. Thank you, Andrea. Felicita, tell me three about Francisco. 
Francisco always brews my cheese. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold Three. on. Look, listen to me, Felicita. Oh. Okay. You are telling me Francisco always brushes his Brush. teeth. Okay. Yeah. Tenga le cuidadito a ese his. Porque me acaba de decir que Francisco le sacó yeah, yeah. a usted. Okay, be careful. <laughs> Perdón. No problem, no problem. Good, good. Yeah. yeah. Francisco always brush his teeth three times. Okay, you don't uh, need to say the times. No necesita decir las veces porque ya me dijo. Ah, oh. okay, okay. Uh, Francisco rarely dancing once. Ah, 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 ah. Francisco rarely goes rarely dancing. Rarely dancing. Francisco usually is, is, stay up late. Late, late. Perfect. That's enough. Felicita, excellent. Yeah. Well done, well done. Walter, please tell me about Andrea. I'm curious about Andrea. Tell me. Okay, teacher. Andrea always brews your drinks. No, mine no. Hair. You know, teeth. please, perdón. No problem, no problem. Okay. Uh, Andrea, good dancing, usually. Okay, listen, Walter. Andrea usually goes dancing. Okay. Uh, Andrea usually stay out late. Stays up. Day out. Stays up late. Stay out late. Andrea Perfect. usually good the movie. Goes to the movie. Goes to the movie. Thank you, teach. You're welcome. Andrea usually do the laundry. Okay, again, listen, Walter. Andrea usually does the laundry. Does the laundry. Please. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, now let's see, let's see who else. We still got time. Todavía tenemos tiempo. So let's check. That was Andrea Walter. Mariela, please tell me about Carlos. Tell me what you found out. Cuénteme, que averiguó. <laughs> Carlos always brushes his teeth. Perfect. Carlos sometimes goes dancing. Goes, goes. Goes, goes dancing. Carlos normally stays up late. Perfect. Thank you very much. Uh, continue or finish? Uh, let me check the time. Continue. Tell me the five. Carlos seldom goes, goes to the movie. Mm. Carlos rarely does the laundry. Oh my gosh, Carlos. Carlos, please, Carlos. Tell me about Mariela. I want to know. I remember that Mariela never does the laundry. She says that it damages uh, her nails. No. She always brushes her teeth. Okay. She usually goes dancing. Oh, interesting. Hmm. She always stays up late. Yeah, of course. She goes dancing, she stays up late. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Carlos. Thank you, Mariela. You're welcome. Okay, 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 okay. Tell me about Miss Noemi de Valencia. Okay. Okay. She readily goes dancing. Okay, um, perfect. Before COVID, Noemi usually goes to the movies. Ah, she usually goes to the movies. Okay, perfect. Yeah. She usually do the laundry a week. Does. Does the laundry. Um, does. 
He usually do the laundry. Uh, uh, he usually does the laundry. She usually does the laundry a week. Okay, weekly. Weekly. Okay, uh, look, weekly. Look, look, she okay. usually does the laundry. Remember, does, does, because we are talking oh. about her. Como estamos hablando de la tercera persona, de él, de ella, o de eso. Al verbo le agregamos la yes. S. Das. Ok. Yes. Ok. Thank you. No, thanks to you. Thank you, mister. Please, Noemi, tell me about Grecia. Okay. Grecia never goes dancing. Oh, really? Wow. Why not? Dancing is nice. I love it. Please continue. <laughs> she sometimes sometime stays up late. Mm. And she often does the laundry. Uh, I don't believe her that much. <laughs> let's continue, let's continue, let's continue. Let's see who's next. Who's next, who's next? And Fausto, tell me about Pedro. I want to know about Pedro. Pedro is very quiet. Pedro muy callado, so let's find out. Pedro always brushes his teeth. Okay, perfect. Um, he never go dancing. Okay. He usually stays up late. Okay. Remember, Fausto goes, goes dancing. Goes, goes dancing. Okay, perfect. Thank you, Pedro. Tell me about Fausto. Um. Fausto always brushes his teeth. Okay, good. Fausto usually stay up late. Uh -huh. Fausto never does the laundry. Oh my gosh. That's... <laughs> uh, Fausto uh, uh, occasionally uh, goes down. Okay, perfect. Excellent, mm -hmm. excellent. Thank you very much, Pedro. Very well done. Now, let's see, let's see. Am I missing someone? Que me falta? Okay, okay, okay. Oh, Carla, Marielos, tell me about Miss Magaña. Yesenia always brushes her teeth. Yesenia usually goes to the movie. Yesenia normally stay at late. Yesenia seldom goes dancing. Perfect. Thank you very much, Carla. Now, please, uh, Yesenia, tell me about Carla. Okay. Carla brush brushes. Carla. Uh, always brush uh, her teeth. teeth. Brushes, brushes, remember. Brushes. Brushes. Yes. Brushes. Um, Carla normally goes to dancing. Oh, really? Goes dancing. Monkey. Goes dancing. Okay. Goes dancing. Yes, one more, one more, Yesenia. Una más. Eh, una más. Eh, she usually goes, goes to the movies in okay. the weekend. Okay, perfect. Now, let's see. Thank you, Yesenia. Now, let's see. Let's see. Eliani, okay. tell me about Jorge. Jorge, I never get to see Jorge. I want to know about him. Nunca veo Jorge. I want to know about him. Tell me. Jorge never goes to the movies. Oh, really? That's Jorge, Jorge usually brushes his teeth. Jorge usually stay up late. Okay. Jorge never go dancing, goes dancing. Mm, and never, and Jorge usually goes 
goes the laundry. Okay, usually does the laundry. Perfect. Thank you very yes. much, Eliani. Jorge, tell me about Eliani. I know that Eliani never does the laundry, but you tell me, tell me. Este, Eliani usually uh, brush your teeth. No, mine, no. Hair. Hair teeth. Hair teeth. Yeah, you Eliani... know, I'm going to get in trouble. Me voy a meter en lío. Continue. Iliani Ili usually hair brush your teeth. Hair Iliani... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, Jorge. I know your idea, but let's make it clear. Look at the chat, okay? You're telling me that Eliani always bro, I'm sorry, brushes hair brushes. teeth. Okay, hair teeth. Eliani always brushes her teeth. Her means okay. su de ella. Okay? Because in English we have a difference. Ah, her, okay. Her es su específicamente de ella. His okay. es su de él. Okay? And your es su de usted. You see? Okay. Let's continue. Lani always brushes her, her teeth. Perfect. Uh, Eliani uh, goes Eliani usually goes dancing okay good uh, Eliani usually stay up stays up late perfect thank you very much Jorge excellent I guess that was all no 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 Wendy, hello, Wendy. You need to tell me about Alonso, please. Okay. He sometimes stays up late. Perfect. He never goes to the movies. Okay. He occasionally does the laundry. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much, Wendy. Alonso, tell me about Wendy. Uh, Wendy, she always brushes her teeth. Okay, perfect. She never goes dancing. Oh, that's bad. She always step up late. Okay, perfect. She often goes to the movies. Okay, good, good, good. She always does the laundry. Oh, that's nice. That's nice. Thank you very much. Very well done, guys. Perfect. I'm sorry that I know that for some of you was long. But in this exercise, I needed to listen to everybody. In este ejercicio necesitaba oírlos a todos. Because I wanted to know if you remember the positioning. Porque necesitaba verificar que recordaban la posición. If you notice, if se dieron cuenta, we just work with one part of the rule. Hasta este momento hemos trabajado solo con una parte de la regla. Because we still haven't worked with the verb be. Aún no hemos trabajado con el verbo ser o estar. Okay? That's a different rule. But tomorrow we will have enough time for that. Don't worry. Mañana tendremos suficiente tiempo para eso. But before we go there and that you have the rule, Antes de que lleguemos a eso y ahora que a todos comprendieron la regla, I'm going to tell you something uh, a little bit interesting. Les voy a contar acerca de algo. There's one of the albers that is a rebel. Doesn't follow the rules. Hay un alberbio rebelde. Yeah, he doesn't like the rule. No, que no le gustan las reglas. And I will tell you, I will tell you right now which one is it. Okay, look. Uh, okay, we're gonna do it here. Look at this sentence. I sometimes do the laundry. Sometimes 
I do the laundry. I do the laundry sometimes. Okay, you see these sentences? The rule says, the rule and listen, subject, albero frequency, verb, okay? In this case, sometimes it's the rebel, it's deception, because sometimes can go according to the rule, first case, before the subject, or at the end. And the three sentences are correct. The three sentences are exactly correct. Look, I sometimes do the laundry. Sometimes I do the laundry. I do the laundry sometimes. The three sentences are correct. Las tres oraciones son correctas. In the case of sometimes it can go according to the rule, de acuerdo a la regla, before the structure, al inicio, or at the end. And in the three situations, it's correct. Okay? Es el único que te, se puede ubicar en cualquier parte. No problem. Where is it possible? Why is it possible? Oh, because what you want to emphasize ¿Qué es lo que quiere enfatizar? In the case of sometimes, it allows that. En el caso de sometimes, permite eso. Look, I sometimes do the laundry, the regular sentence, you see? This is normal. Sometimes, I do the laundry. Listen to the intonation. I sometimes do the laundry. Sometimes, I do the laundry. You see, in this case, I am emphasizing the fact that I do the laundry. En la segunda estoy enfatizando el hecho de que yo lavo la ropa. Okay? Sometimes I do the laundry. In this case, I do the laundry sometimes. I do the laundry sometimes. You see? It sounds different. The idea is different. La idea es un poquito diferente. In this case, it's normal. I sometimes do the laundry. Aquí está expresando la frecuencia. In this case, I am emphasizing that I do the laundry. Okay? And in this case, I am giving importance to the fact of doing the laundry. En este caso le estoy dando importancia al hecho de lavar la ropa. Acá es importante la frecuencia. Acá es importante quién ejecuta la actividad con esa frecuencia. Acá es importante el hecho, la acción. That's the difference. ¿Ok? But mostly what matters there is the intonation, okay? Listen, I sometimes do the laundry. Sometimes I do the laundry. I do the laundry sometimes. You see? It's not just the sentence, it's the intonation. También es la entonación. What transmits the correct idea. Is that clear for you now, Francisco? ¿Se entendió ahora? I think I lost Francisco. Okay, guys. Any question be or any question before we leave? Alguna preguntita más? No. No. Okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. I know that. Don't worry that this topic is not over yet. No se preocupen que este tema no lo hemos terminado. We're going to talk a bit more with the Alberts, okay? Because they are very interested. Hey, guys. Thank you very much. I appreciate your patience. Aprecio mucho su paciencia. I know that this topic is very difficult. Uh, see you tomorrow. If you think up any any question, any doubt, write it down and tell me tomorrow. 
Si se les ocurre alguna otra duda que tenía, me la dan mañana con gusto. ¿Ok? Bye bye. Have a good night. Bye. 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 Rest. Thank you.